This video is going to show you how to solve equations by using common base, except we're going to start with a fraction this time. So I have 10 to the x minus 1 power is equal to 1 over 10 to the x plus 1. So first I want to get rid of that fraction. So I'm going to keep the left side of my equation. And on the right side, instead of 1 over 10, I'm going to make this 10 to the negative 1 power and I still have that x plus 1. Because if you remember back to your laws of exponents, 1 over x to the a is equal to x to the negative a. So therefore, I had 1 over 10. This is equivalent to 10 to the negative 1 power. Now, a power to a power tells me to multiply. So I'm going to distribute this negative 1 to each piece. The left side stays. The right side is 10 to the negative x minus 1. I have a common base of 10, so I'm worried about my exponents only. So x minus 1 is equal to negative x minus 1. I'm going to solve for x by adding x on both sides. So I get 2x minus 1 equals negative 1. Add 1 on both sides, so 2x equals 0 divide by 2, x equals 0. And there's my answer. Let's look at one more example with a fraction. So I have 1 fourth to the x power equals 8 to the 1 minus x power. I'm going to start by writing this as 4 to the negative 1. And that x power is still there. Because remember, 1 over 4 is equivalent to 4 to the negative 1. So now a power to a power tells me to multiply. So I have 4 to the negative x is equal to 8 to the 1 minus x. I want to get a common base. So the common base between 4 and 8 is going to be 2 because 2 squared gives me 4 and 2 cubed gives me 8. So I'm going to rewrite 4 as 2 squared. That negative x is still there. And I'm going to write 8 as 2 cubed with the 1 minus x still there. Now a power to a power tells me to multiply. So I get 2 to the negative 2x is equal to 2, and I have to distribute this 3, to the 3 minus 3x. Once my bases are the same, they both have 2s, I worry about my exponents only. So my equation is negative 2x equals 3 minus 3x. I'm going to solve for x by adding 3x to both sides. So we get 1x equals 3, or just x equals 3 as your answer. And that's how you solve equations with common base when there's a fraction.